both nasdaq 100 and us 30 both trading with a little drop failing to go past by the entry levels which i shared on the weekly chart that these is the level that is 3800 and 13600 for us 30 and us 100 where you can go long both fail to a break pass by these levels trading with a drop now what is going to happen today which position you should take in order to make profit we will see with the help of candlestick charts and indicators this analysis will be valid till i come up with my next analysis before the us cash session so first thing is do not commit this mistake by not subscribing this channel yes you are losing on the profits daily twice i am sharing my upload definitely it will help you in your day trading decisions also you can watch on my other analysis on gold silver oil natural gas for seed germany also do press the bell icon now let's start the day first we look into FTSE 100 followed with dow jones do watch till the end do listen to it carefully look at the early charts strong bullish run consolidation trying to break out probably it may try to eliminate some of the gains or erase some of the gains can come back till towards 13450 and in fact 13400 levels before it looks over to rise any long entry is beyond 13550 that is very clear till the time it trades below 13550 do not go long there directional movement is bullish stochastic is looking downwards MACD is uh, bullish it is willing to convert see whenever you see bullish or whenever you see the markets are bullish you can find bullish momentum is very fast and while dropping it just drops very slow so that it can cool off some of the indicators so that it can reverse again and retrace again and now look at the rsi this is also overbought hence it may let, so see a little cooling out there it can drop a little it can retrace a little look at the two hour charts likewise on the two hour charts see lower highs only short entry i'll recommend is below 13480 Below 13480 you can go short and then you can find out 13450 400 levels to provide very strong support. Only long entry is beyond 13550 where you can expect it to remain bullish. Between 13550 13480 do not trade. Directional movement is bullish. It is willing to converge. Stochastic is overbought here on the 2 hour charts. Remember stochastic is overbought. Now looking downwards it can call for a little drop. MACD is trading in bullish zone it is still green RSI is near to top let's have a more detailed look on 3 hour charts on the 3 hour charts lower highs and yes it is still trying to trade BSC lower highs indicates that there are bears out there see and it can drop a little how far it can come it can come back back till towards 13450 and 13420400 zone which is going to be fairly strong support zone yes do not go long all till the time it is below 13550 that is one observation only below 13550 you can expect or no, only above 13550 you can expect to go long and then it, it may act bullish directional movement is bullish it may start to converge stochastic is overbought now looking downwards it may call for cooling see it overbought then a little retracement overbought a little retracement this is how the markets work directional movement is uh, MACD is still bullish it may start to converge rsa is near to top may look forward to a downward momentum four hour charts see a little rise retracement rise retracement this is how it is trying to trade probably you have to watch out for 13480 below that yes you can expect 13450 400 and then 13350 300 zone so yes and once it breaks below 13300 it will call for more bears out there then we can look forward to 13200 13000 levels directional movement is bullish it may start to converge stochastic is overbought on the four hour charts and that is why we are looking at a red candle macd is in green and can converge crossover rsi is near to top indicates it is little bullish uh, it was little bullish till now it may slope again on the downside look at the moment on the daily charts one green candle a smaller red candle another green candle candle size is diminishing a uh, the weekend candle you can eliminate another red candle may give you couple of red candles may give you this support here at 13400 and 300 is going to be strong below 13300 it will call for bears out there then it may drop else it can achieve 13400 levels 13350 levels and bounce back from here so till the time it trades as i shared in my weekly analysis also till the time it trades below 13 above 13300 we can expect it may bounce back now today till the time it is up below 13550 you can remain short definitely see on the daily charts directional movement is extremely bullish it may start converging from here stochastic is overbought too and it can look forward to a drop macd is trading in green since long it may converge crossover for a sell rsi is overbought too hence you can expect a little drop from here and uh, yes you can stay stay short till the time it is below 13550 you can take a risk of uh, 30 points as right now it is at 13520 and yes 
uh, probably or those who want to take a safe entry can take a short entry at 13480 and below that you can expect 13450 first support 13400 next support 13350 300 as the next support levels it can drop till there and yes till the time it trades above 13300 probably it can bounce back again so yes stay cautious there on the upside be watchful of 13550 beyond which you can expect 13600 the major resistance and beyond that we can see it flying for 13750 13820 13 and 14000 levels also so be cautious take your positions accordingly trade with the stop loss trade with the trailing stop loss and now let's have a look at down us 30 on the early charts has seen a high there a strong greener candles we have seen taking it to extreme bullish extreme outside the bullinger bands and now it is trying to retrace the resistance there at 31720 is strong beyond that yes you can go long the support there at 31650 is good Be below that yes you can expect it to come back for 31600 and then 31500 level 31500 is a very good support Directional movement bullish is looking downwards. The stock ISTIC stick is at bottom. MACD is willing to converge crossover. RSI is looking downwards here. Likewise, if you see at the 2R charts, on the 2R charts, trying to create a symmetry, trying to drop. Remember, it is trying to trade in this channel and hence the support here at 33,600 is going to be very, very strong. Below that, it may drop for 33,500, 33,400. And this is the level which we may look into below that it can try to drop strongly. It has to cover this momentum there and probably it can come back till towards 3200 levels. Directional movement is bullish, willing to converge a little. A stochastic is overbought on the 2 hour charts, looking downwards. MACD is green, willing to converge. RSI is overbought and hence looking forward to a drop there. On the 3 hour charts, similar is the observation, only long entry is beyond 33, 720 and a good short entry if you want to take, if you safe, want to take safe, probably you can take a short entry at 33, 600 but yes, you, you can still remain short till the time it is below 33, 720, we can still expect it to drop, first target at 33, 600, then it should come back till towards 33, 580 and 33, 500 levels, below 33, 500 we can see a good fall. Directional movement bullish willing to converge. The stochastic is overbought looking downwards from here. MACD is willing to converge. RSI is overbought looking downwards from here indicating little bearishness there. On the 4 hour charts look at the candles out there. The smaller candle and then a retracement support there at 33,650 and then 33,600 should come into picture. Below that you can expect it to come for 33,500, 400 levels. So it may try to raise some of the gains. See, the support here at 33, 550, 500 is going to be very, very strong and it can continue to trade in this bullish channel. But remember this time it failed to achieve the highs of this channel indicates below 33, 500 definitely it will call for it will bears which may bring it till to a 33, 400, 300, 200 levels. You can see directional movement extremely bullish. It must start to converge. The stock ISTIC is overbought looking downwards from here. MACD is bullish. It may start to converge. RSI is overbought on the daily charts and 4-hour four, four charts and look at the daily charts. On the daily charts, a step candle on the weekly charts is formed. Red candle and it is looking forward to trade in this channel. The support there at 33,600 first support, 33,550 and then 33,500. Do watch full of, do cautious of these levels and then 33,400 levels. So till 33,400 it can get very strong support then 33,300, 200 levels will come below 33,200 only you can, uh, it will bring bears to the markets only below 33,200 then you can expect 32,800 levels and below that it may fall or crash heavily. On the upside go long above 33,720 beyond that you can stay long for 33,800 and beyond that it will fly directional movement extremely bullish. It may start to converge from now stochastic overbought and hence it may try to converge from here. MACD is bullish, it must start to converge, it is trading in a bullish zone since long now and RSI is overbought too, it, it is entering into overbought levels after a little while. So most of the indicators are overbought and hence it may call for a little retracement, let's see. And yes, you can remain short with this stop loss at 33,720, you can remain short, probably you can expect a little drop, first target at 33,600, then 33,550, 500 and below that it may drop up and you can stay short with this stop loss at 33,720. And till the time it is above 33200, you have to always keep closing at every target 33400, 300 and re-enter again if you see it moving in your direction. On the upside, you can go along at 33720, you can expect 33800, very strong resistance beyond that. 
it will fly directly to 34,000 in plus plus levels. So take your trades accordingly. Trade profitably, trade with a stop loss, trade with a telling stop loss. Join my mentorship batch, join my VIP signals group. Reach out to me for more details. My telegram and email ID are mentioned in the channel and video description. Definitely the strategy is taught in my mentorship batch will help you become a profitable and proficient trader. Reach out to me for more details. Join my free telegram channel. The link is mentioned in the video description. Thank you very much. Have a great profitable trading day. Thank you.